Data from the CDC shows Florida leads the nation in the number of new HIV cases. Duval County has the fourth highest rate in the state with about 29 positive tests per 100,000 people. Joining us this morning is Dr. Mohamed, Mohamed Reza, excuse me, an infectious disease specialist and the medical director at Can Community Health. Dr. Reza, thank you so much for coming on the show and talking with us. Thank you, Zach. When you heard this, when you saw this information, this new data, what went through your mind? So overall, the numbers have been decreasing over the last 10, 15 years. So it is high, but in Florida, the rates of infection have been high all along. So it's reassuring that mitigation strategies that we have to decrease risk of infection are working. And the biggest thing is getting people educated to let people know that getting tested, knowing your status is so important. Why is that rate in Florida so high? And why is it so high in Duval County? Yeah, I mean, there's there's several reasons. Some are access to care, health care, as well as access to knowledge and information. We see this rate of infection a lot higher in the minority population. If you look at the rate of infection in people who are white living in Duval country, it's about 9.6 per 100,000. But if you look at the African-American community, it's about 58.3 per 100,000. So reaching out to those communities and educating and letting them know that this is not a curable infection at this point, but it is very preventable and treatable and letting them know that that stigma that lays in those communities to, to let them know that this is very treatable and preventable. And with that said, there are several different treatments for those living with the virus. There are, there are several different medications. It's not a death sentence, it's very treatable. A lot of times people, people can take one pill once a day to have this virus be undetectable. And that's the goal of treating this infection, getting that number so low that it's not detectable in the bloodstream. That doesn't mean they're cured. That means it's so low, it's, it doesn't have that effect. And the other important point is if you're undetectable, you cannot transmit that virus to others. That's also so important. You know, when you talk about treatment, there's also uh, a big part of this that's focused on prevention. What are the options when it comes to prevention? For sure, this is an exciting time in our fight against HIV AIDS. So there are medications called PrEP, which stands for pre-exposure prophylaxis. These are pills that you can take one pill once a day. They're either Truvada or Descovy. It would decrease your risk of contracting HIV by 95 to 99%. And I urge anybody that's actually active with multiple partners uh, to get on these medications. And there are other medications that are coming down the line that are injectable medications. One of the exciting things we have available at our clinic at Can Community Health, we're actually the only clinic in Northeast Florida that are conducting this trial. It's called Purpose 2 trial. And it's an injectable. Right now you have to take a pill every day, but this injectable is going to look at one injection every six months to prevent HIV infection. And same is coming through for people living with HIV. There are now medications on the market that if your provider feels it's appropriate, you can take an injection once a month instead of taking a pill every day. I mean, this is just amazing things that we have available coming down to us to prevent HIV as well as treat HIV infection. And it's always exciting to watch you on the front lines with this effort. Dr. Mohamed Reza, thank you so much for joining us this morning. Really quick before we let you go, for people looking uh, to receive more information about HIV AIDS, where can they go to do so? They can go to cancommunityhealth.org. We are a nonprofit organization. We provide free testing as well as treatment, as well as getting you on medications to prevent HIV. And if you don't have insurance and you financially qualify, we will get you insurance as well. So we are here to help. Dr. Reza, thank you. Thank you.